No indigenous life signs. One less thing to worry about, I suppose. Well, you're back. Oh, we'll get to what happened to Barrett. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Don't you lin me. I thought things had already gone sideways, but no, that was just the beginning. More pirates showed up when you were gone. We weren't as lucky this time. Calvert. Troy. Some of the new Dusties. They didn't make it. Well, how could you have? You weren't here. Anyway, I was pinned down behind some crates with Barrett. Bullets and laser fire everywhere. No smile on that damn carefree face of his. Like he knew this was it. I started stealing myself to go out fighting. Then that idiot puts his hand on my shoulder and says, Stay here, Lin. I got you. I do not know Barrett as well as Son, but he seems quite confident in his abilities. And not without cause. Next thing I know, two of the pirates are dead, and he's got the third one in a headlock. Drags him out into the open at gunpoint and demands to talk, or else I'm going to demonstrate Newton's third law on this guy's temporal lobe. And that's when they brought out Hella. <sighs> I didn't overhear everything, but after the ten longest seconds of my life, Barrett put his hands up, and both of them ended up getting taken aboard the pirate ship. And that's the last I saw of either of them. They could have grab-jumped anywhere. I tried pinging a transmission to the ship in the comms building before they left, but the pirates must have fried it. You want to try it? Go ahead. But the odds of them being alive, even if you could find them... <sighs> I've lost a lot of people on this run, Dusty. I just want to pack up. It would seem that the work here has come to an end. trying to take a little too much on, literally.
hope you can succeed at that before we are discovered. get that computer working again? What? Let me see that. <laughs> Funny. Even knowing he's alive, I still never want to see him again. Hella, on the other hand. Okay. Let me send you the location data embedded in the transmission. Find them, okay? Be a while before Argos comes to pick me up. I'll be here if you need me. And hey, if you ever need a little extra help, I've been thinking about a career change lately. Maybe it's time to put Argos behind me. Always a satisfying moment to return to your ship.
Oh, hey, it's you. And here I thought you were some pirate coming back to kill me. Lucky me, right? Considering the spaceship wreckage, you mean? Sorry, brother. I'll get us out of this. Trust me. Yeah, I'm starting to see that. He tells me we need to start pretending. Bingo. Blasted the pipe. Oh, yeah. Probably. I was drifting. Yeah. Just, uh, don't ask me to operate. Still think there might be a spot for me on your ship? I gotta get off this rock. Phew, oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. For a second there, I thought you were gonna leave me behind. What's on the agenda today? You got it. Catch you on the flip side, boss. Thanks for letting me tag along. I can't make out the console. Don't move! He's trying to figure out our destination, probably transmitting this conversation right now while we're still in orbit. Well, yeah. Thought I was making that pretty obvious. Okay, okay, put the gun down. I'm done. See? My retinas are pointing away from the console and towards this lovely view of space we have out the window. Time up. Once we get back to the base, the fun starts. <laughs> Any adventure you can fly away from. Is, is that how the saying goes?
out of the earth. <laughs> Good one. What the best we can do. Certainty to the universe at all. Once you really start getting out. You're pulling my leg again, right? actually found me. I do not understand. Is Barrett being held hostage or not? Well, this is turning into a regular constellation party, isn't it? I should have bought drinks. You know, it's actually been kind of nice. Matsura the Grim here is a great host. No sense letting people's last moments be unpleasant. See, that's what I like about you, Matsura. Real renaissance man. I have enjoyed our time together, Barrett. But I can't just let you go with nothing to show for it. Is Constellation willing to pay ransom in exchange for this man's freedom? You want me to end all this with nothing to show for it? He does seem to be unusually skilled in that area. He has been more entertaining than most hostages. Barrett has some good friends, it seems. Very well. You're all free to go. It's been a real pleasure, Matsura. Really. And good luck out there with all the, you know, hurting people and taking their money.
Do not speak. I would like a chance to talk to you, if you are Sorry able. for the wait, everyone. Got a little held up on Vectera. Barrett, we were worried sick. Well, some of us were. I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. Actually, Walter has been complaining about you more than usual, which is always a sign that he's worried. Don't start, country. Wait, is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library shelf. Now, look at them all. You feel it a bit, can't you? Ever since I found the second one, I had the visions. Being around them is just comforting. So hey, I I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around, help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe? Marvelous. If you have a moment, I have something I'd like to discuss.